Hi. Today I'm going to be doing a science experiment to see what happens when you mix super glue with styrofoam. Got here a regular thin piece of styrofoam, but for this experiment it doesn't matter if it's thin or whether it's thick. The result is still going to be the same. Take some uh, super glue and I'm going to put it right in the center of the styrofoam. Pour it into like a decent sized circle here. Now it doesn't take long. It only takes uh, maybe just a, like a minute or two. But once the uh, once the super glue mixes with the styrofoam, there's a reaction that takes place. Now I learned this several years ago. I was trying to make a foam glider and I thought well I thought why don't I just super glue the wings to the actual body of the plane and when I did the super glue had reacted with the foam and was eating the plane at the wings. So, until that point, I didn't know that you shouldn't mix super glue with styrofoam. I just thought glue was glue, except some was stronger than others. So we'll let this just sit for just a moment. It's already starting to react. Now there's, there's uh, glue out there that you can buy specifically for styrofoam. And I imagine you could probably use regular Elmer's glue, but uh, there's also a styrofoam glue that you can buy. It's not a fast process when it eats the styrofoam. But it's definitely already causing a uh, an indentation into the foam. Now the reason that this is eating the styrofoam uh, is probably because there's acetone inside the super glue. Acetone and styrofoam definitely do not mix. Styrofoam will completely dissolve styrofoam. So acetone will dissolve styrofoam uh, and I don't know if you can see this or not but you can already see I hope there's like a crater forming in the uh, in the styrofoam where I put the super glue. The sun's shining right at uh, right at me, so I don't know if you can tell uh, from looking at it yet or not. And we're gonna let this just keep working. Starting to get a little more reactive now. The deeper in it goes. And like I said, it doesn't happen fast 
but you could glue something you could super glue something styrofoam together think everything's cool come back and the whole thing's falling apart I would say that the, the crater itself right now is at least almost a, almost an eighth of an inch deep, if not a little deeper. I'm waiting for it to come through on the other side. Come here. Come here. Come here. I don't know if it Should be coming through the other side just any second now. And you can see, you can see the hole that it's created, and you can also see where it's starting to come through on the reverse side. In fact, if I were to take a small stick, look how gooey and melted it's made the styrofoam. And if I would have just let it sit there, it would have made a hole all the way through on its own. But you saw there was a little effort. I mean, it's just it's just a melted mess from the super glue styrofoam mixing. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you next time.